Hey my YouTube family, hey my dolls and dudes. You can already tell summer time is coming because time you step out of the house you are sweating. So we are on our way to the beach. Not to bathe or anything. Um, we're gonna watch some kayaking. My best friend Dion, he does this kayaking so <clears throat> let me reverse okay so he does kayaking so we're just gonna watch it you know just to come and show our support for him um it's my first time actually going and watch it i mean i watch videos etc of him kayaking so we're actually gonna watch it in person um this sport is new to dominica so it's very interesting to see how he and his team are going to develop the sport and hopefully one day make it very big in Dominica. Um, was just there listening to the radio, but I hope they don't play any music because, of course, I don't want to get copyrighted because of YouTube, any little thing they're ready to copyright. So. We're just going down the road by a Marboid area. So that's where I think they're practicing. So we're just going down there. So I will take you guys with me. Alright, YouTube. So with me, I have my best friend Dion, who is also the coach of the Dominica kayaking teams, the different teams. So we are going to talk to him about kayaking, and he's going to let us know more about kayaking in Dominica. Hi guys, um, I'm Dion. I'm an athlete and a coach with the Dominica Kayaking Association. Um, we're out today using our surf skis. It's a sea worthy craft which we use for events on the seawater. A lot of fun. We have a lot of great sceneries around Dominica, so really enjoy being out on the water and enjoy the spot. Um, like, if you know about kayaking, you know there's different types of kayaks. We have the sprint kayaks, the surf ski, the recreation kayaks. What we mainly use now is the surf ski. We're just going into sprint kayaks. So, you'll hear more from us again. We're planning to have a few events coming up. So, keep tuned and you'll get more information. So this is what kayak? This is a sprint kayak. Sprint kayak, okay. So that's where you sit. Oh, it's pretty hard. So this one you sit into it. Yes. And this one you sit on it. Okay. And what's that green part in the center there for? This is like a storage bin. Oh, okay. We can much store your stuff and keep them dry. Okay. This is the cockpit or where the sitting area. Yeah. And this is the footrest which consists of the control arms which allow you to turn the rotors okay. which controls the direction in which your boat turns. Okay. Again, we have the your rotors. rotors. Okay. And the trust wheel panel. And you would say that for this sport you need plenty of strength? Plenty of strength, endurance and balance. Okay, so strength, endurance and balance. Okay. So if you're watching this vlog and you all are interested in kayaking, then of course send a message and I'll get you into contact with Dion.
should have recorded an intro for this part, but we are at Jacko Falls. <laughs> On to Soka and Mimosa. So that's where Kiano and I are going. We're going to Soka and Mimosas. <laughs> Now let us replay this in slow motion.
do on the footage of Soka and Mimosa, okay? So, we just came from DGS graduation. I wanted to film a get ready with me, but honestly, I was out of time, so I didn't have the time to film it. But uh, it is over with, it is done. Maybe if I get some clips, I will try to show you a little bit of highlights of it. It was a good graduation and I'm really proud of all the students that graduated. They worked hard and yeah. Now it is lunchtime. Um, my mother cooked um, for the chicken pasta on Sunday. So you know that doesn't really stretch. Usually if you make a big macaroni and cheese or something, you will have it as leftovers for Monday. But that doesn't really stretch. So right now I am actually in the drive-thru of KFC and I'm gonna buy some food for me and my mother well, my mother and I English I'm gonna buy some food for us um, that's about it this is my um, wig that I put flexi rods in and it gets this curl and I have my little leopard print headband and the leopard print dress now it's not really the same leopard print but for the time being oh well that's what i'm gonna use let me get my order
Oh, you don't have the jam, no? No. Nah. They're always missing something there. You never have something that you want. And my earrings, which were picked out by somebody special. Yeah. So, um, I think I am going to film a, a skincare routine. Now, please don't mind this like huge, huge, huge pimple that is there. Honestly, it's monthly, so yeah. But you know, a nice skincare routine. What I do when I have the time, not every day, only when I have the time. So. When I reach home, maybe I can show you all my outfit of the day, and yeah, that's about it. Hey guys, so today is the 29th of June, and it's extremely rainy. It's been raining for quite a number of days, three days in total. Today is Wednesday, so it's been raining Monday, it's been raining Tuesday, and now it's been, it is raining Wednesday. I'm going to think that the rain will stop at least by Friday. We keep our fingers crossed. If you guys know me, you will know that my favorite lip color when I go out is red. I love a red lip. Now, I've been trying to find the type of red lip which I love the most. Now, my favorite red lip is Max Ruby Woo. And this is this lipstick right here, MAC Ruby Woo. Now it's a matte lipstick, it's red but with a blue based undertone and that's my favorite. Now as you can clearly see like your girl has been using this. Now I wanted to find other alternatives because with the thing with this lipstick is I only get it when I go to the US. So if I don't go to the US, then I won't get this lipstick. So this lipstick right here. And let's do some color swatches. This is what it looks like. I really, 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 really love this lipstick. So I wanted to find cheaper alternatives to this lipstick. And I found dupes, I would say, for this lipstick. Now, the first dupe is one that we can find in Dominica. We can find it by Jolly's. We can find it by um, um, The Glams. Okay. Which is this uh, Sasha Intense Matte Velvet Lipstick in the color Hello Boys. It's another red. It's another blue based red. And watch this right here. So this one is a bit brighter, but it's another blue based red. And it's also matte, which I love. Now, another cheap alternative or cheaper alternative is the Juvia's Place lipstick. And this one is in the color perfect red and it's another blue based red but the only thing with this lipstick is that it is a soft matte it's not full on matte meaning that it's it glides on a lot easier than the matte ruby woo and lastly we have this color Elena from Tom Ford so we have this Tom Ford lipstick but this is a velvet finish but as you can see all these are some beautiful red colors so if you're like me and you really really want a red lipstick and you don't know what to choose if you are in the states or you can get somebody to send it down for you i would definitely tell you to try the mac ruby woo if you can't get your hands on this and you're in dominica then you can always get your hands on the sasha hello boys 
if you can't get this Juvia's, you can always order a lipstick from Juvia's. Juvia's does ship to Dominica well, well if you have Aeropost or West Tech or etc etc so you can always order this color in the color perfect red and uh, last but not least but this is actually the most expensive lipstick which is a Tom Ford it's in the color Elaine number four very expensive it's more expensive than the Mac but it's a very very pretty red lipstick I don't really use this one often because when it's done trust me it's done and I'm not buying it back it's too expensive so here are the color swatches once more so So if you're ever looking for that perfect red lip, then I will tell you all to check these lipsticks out. Okay, guys? Look at the weather. It's raining off and on, off and on. But as you can see, this area right here, there is blue skies. Over here is grey. But eventually, the sun is trying to pick through. The next scene you are about to see are my co-workers and I. We are about to go to Point Michel where we are going to have a quick get together, the technical department, before the school year closes. In Point Michel, we are going to Peanuts Mountain Resort. But we are waiting on the ride because they said the road is very bad and we cannot drive. So we are all just waiting. Michelle, I came to Amazon for my aunt Jennifer's birthday.
after one year big chop i can finally say that my hair can go in a one so i'm proud of the growth just after one year i also discovered this product hair wax with olive oil they have different flavors lemon strawberry etc and it's really good it slicks down your hair very good and i will comment down below where it is that i purchased this product